Hello all of you lovely listeners and welcome to another video here on Lily Budgets. If you are a returning subscriber, thank you so much for your continued support. And if you are new here, my name is Lily and I am so thankful that you've clicked on this video and are here to spend some time with me today. I am a 22 year old cash budgeter and stuffer and I am just trying to live life happy over here while on this budgeting and savings journey. So if that sounds like content that may interest you and you have not yet hit that subscribe button, I would greatly appreciate it if you would take a quick moment to do so and send some support my way. We just hit 900 subscribers, which I still cannot believe. So thank you again so much to everyone who has subscribed and the next giveaway will be at 1000. So hopefully, we can get there soon. Today, you guys, we are going to be doing the biggest bill exchange that I have done yet. Um, we are also going to be unstuffing our monthly expenses and counting up all our categories for our February sinking funds update. Now, I haven't done a bill swap since I want to say November. Don't quote me on that. Um, but the binders are getting thick and we are ready to condense them. So without further ado, I have $3,500 in 100s here to help with the exchange. For those of you who are new to cash stuffing or um, are just curious about where this money came from, I do have a few thousand dollars saved in my bank account with Ally. It is a high yield savings account and I use placeholders to represent the money that is in my envelopes. So I took a thousand out of that for this. And then I realized that I was definitely going to need more than that, but I didn't have enough time to do the transfer. So my dad loaned me the extra 2,500 and I'm just going to give it right back to him after the exchange. So with that being said, let's quickly give this account to make sure that we do in fact have 3,500 here. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 1,000, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 2,000, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 3,000, 1, 2, 3, 4, and 5. So 3,500 is right here, and I'm going to pop those. Oh, oh my gosh, I've never had, uh, I have not had that many $100 bills in my hand, so pretty crazy. So with that being said, I have my little um, tracker here that's just letting me know that a thousand of this or whatever's left is going to go to Ally and 2,500 is going to go to my dad. And then I am going to grab my big girl binder here. Just a quick reminder um, that this whole budget booklet is available on my Etsy shop and the March budget booklet did release um, last week when you're seeing this or earlier this week. Um, so that is available if you'd like. And for everyone who has reached out to me and asked for a customizable budget booklet, I am coming out with one very soon. Um, it is the standard five weeks. It has everything included, but it is just, you know, no more neutral colors and, um, the calendar is blank. So you can just, clear it out at the end of the month and rewrite in the numbers and you can reuse it if you're interested in that. So I will keep you guys posted on my Instagram specifically and then I'll mention it here as well when those are available. But with that being said, we do have to unstuff some of our monthly expenses. So starting off with insurance, my car insurance payment is $62 a month. So we have 20, 40, 50, 60, 61, and 62. So we do have the full payment. I'm just going to write 62 right there so I can remember. And then I'm going to pop these up here. And I'm going to put the ones off to the side so that we'll have some room. <laughs> okay. And this, um, my car insurance and registration envelopes are from the Planning Dancer. We're not going to count registration because that is due in August. Um, these next few envelopes are from Monet's Money. Um, okay, so my phone bill is $50 a month, so we have 20 40 45 and 50 So this will, this will all go to my parents as well. 
Um, I am on a family family plan for their phone bill and my car insurance. Um, I'm on their car insurance, so I just pay them cash and they take care of it. Um, and that is, I'm going to skip to student loans because we do have to take some out of here. So I have 1000 saved in the bank with Ally. These are the placeholders that I was mentioning. And my student loan payment is 400 a month and that is what I have here. 51, 52, 53, 50, and 400. So we're going to pop those right there and that will auto draft from my bank account on March March 8th. I believe so I'll just make sure that that is in there when that is going to come out but that should be it for what we are um, pulling out so while we're in this binder here we will start with the sinking funds update we might as well so we don't stuff count any of these but my mortgage category um, is sort of like a pretend bill that I keep in here and it's just extra savings trying to get ahead on future potential mortgage or rent payments. So we have 1000 saved in the bank with Ally, 20, 40, 60, 81, 20, 30, 35, 40, 45, and 50. So for mortgage we have 1000, 150, and I'm going to put all of this back and grab 150. 1,150 is in mortgage and I have my little calculator over here. So we started the month with 1,100 and we ended with 1,150. So that is a positive change of $50 in mortgage. Okay, my annuals is for my um, Sam's Club membership. We're not going to count that. We're not going to count taxes either. My Best Buy bill, which you know what? I forgot to unstuff some of these. So let's go right back to that. My Best Buy bill, we are doing $50 this month. So 20, 40, 45, and 50. Okay, and then my, these two are from um, Simple Shops on Etsy. Credit card, we're also doing 50, 20, 40, 45, and 50. Okay, that should be it for the unstuffing. So, student loans is all set. My birthday challenge, I think I'm going to hold off on this until next month. I still don't entirely know what I want to do with this extra money, um, but we will we'll figure it out. <laughs> okay, and then manifest, we have a savings challenge going. And just to remind you guys, this is the little manifest savings tracker. We have a goal of 500. These are available on my shop as well. Okay, so for Manifest, we started the month with 265 and we're ending with 150, 200, 20, 40, 50, 55, 60, 65, 70, 75, 80, 85, and 90. So 200 and 90 minus 265, we saved 25 in here 100 okay so this is 50 70 75 80 85 90 95 100 5 and 10 what did i do 150 70 90 80 <laughs> why did i even think that okay this is why we double check so this is 50, 60, 65, 70, 75, 80, 85, 90, 95, and 100. There we go. So we'll grab 100. And we now have 100, 200, 250, 270, and 290 in manifest. So close to 300. Okay emergency this is a big one this is why we needed so many hundreds so 
emergency. We started the month with 1,640. We have 1,000 saved in the bank with Ally. 51, 52, 53, 50, 70, 90, 4, 10, 30, 50, 70, 90, 5, 10, 30, 50, 70, 90, 6, 10, 630, 50, 70, 90, 710, 737, 50, 60, 70, 80, 85, 90, 95, and 1800. So we are going to exchange all of these for $100 bills. I am so excited for this, and hopefully, next month we will be able to hit 2K and we can put another thousand dollar placeholder in there but i am going to take one two three four five six seven eight one hundreds and we will quickly double count one thousand one two three four five six seven eight oh my atlanta so much better one thousand eight hundred and minus the 1640 that we started with, we saved $160 in our emergency fund this month. Okay, next is car. This is also a savings challenge. This is a $1,500 goal. It could be for car maintenance, but I am using it to save up to pay my grandmother back for the car that she gave me. So we started with 360 and we still have 1, 2, 3, 350, 55, and 60. So no change there, but that is a-okay. And I'm going to take these two fives and swap them out for a 10, 1, 2, 3, 50, 60. Okay, we don't count extra debt, um, but our 52 week challenge, which this little insert is also available, we started the month with 161, and we have 50, 70, 90, 110, 30, 50, 60, 70, 80, 85, 90, 95, 200, 205, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40, 45, 50, 55, 60, 65, 70, 271, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 80, 1, 2, and 3. So 283 minus the 161 we started with, we saved $122 in here. So we need 50, 70, 80, and three. And so this should be 20, 40, 60, 80, 91, 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40, 45, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 91, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, and 100. So maybe I should stop waiting two months <laughs> between bill exchanges. Maybe we need one every month. Also, I mentioned in um, this week's cash stuffing on Tuesday that we I did order a cash tray that will have the money kind of lay a little flatter. So I'm hoping that that comes in soon and we can kind of upgrade the look a little bit. But for now, 150, 70, 80, and 1, 2, and 3. I need two of these. There we go. Goodness gracious. 1, 2, 50, 70, 80, and 1, 82, and 83. Okay. And that will be it for this binder. And I am going to grab my move out binder. And we are going to total up all of these categories and figure out how much we saved in this binder as a whole. Um, and we're going to condense them because they are stinking full. <laughs> so, starting off with Home Essentials, we have, I don't, we're not going to see how much we saved in each envelope, but we're going to total it all up, and then at the end we'll see how much we saved um, towards moving out as a whole. 
So we have 1, 200, 50, 70, 90, 310, 30, 50, 70, 90, 410, 430, 440, 45, 50, 55, 60, 65, 70, 71, 2, 3, 4, and 5. So 475, just double check, 50, 70, 5, and this should be 20, 40, 60, 81, 20, 40, 60, 70, 75, 80, 85, 90, 95, 6, 7, 8, 9, and 200. So we will grab 200s and home essentials. Guys, 1, 2, 3, 400, 450, 70, and 475. Perfect. Oh, already so much better. Okay. Decor has 100, 150, 70, 90, 210, 30, 50, 70, 90, 300, 10, 20, 25, 30, 35, and 40. So 340. So we will need that and we have 50, 70, 80, uh, 50, 70, 90, 110, 30, 50, 60, 70, 80, 85, 90, 95, and 200 here. My dad asked me to um, exchange them back at the bank into big bills before I give them back to him. So this will be a fun trip to the bank. <laughs> so we have... 1, 2, 320, and 340 saved for decor. We'll add that here. Okay, remodel. This one is ripping, but hopefully before March starts, before we can get the ball rolling on March's budget, um, we could potentially have some new envelopes here, so super exciting. But for remodel, we have 50, 120, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 85, 90, 95, and 200. So I'm going to put all of this back and grab 200s. And remodel has 200. And we will add that there. Furniture is a big one. Goodness gracious. So, furniture has 1, 2, 300, 350, 70, 90, 410, 30, 50, 70, 90, 510, 530, 550, 70, 90, 600, 10, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40, 45, and 50. So, this should be 300. Yep, okay. So, we are going to grab three more hundreds. I kind of tried to do the math ahead of time and I don't think we'll need all of these hundreds, but I am hoping that at least we don't end up needing more. So furniture has one, two, three, four, five, six hundred and fifty. U-Haul has 20, 40, 50, 55, 60, 65, 70, 75, 80, 85, and 90. So we are going, this should be 50, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40, 45, and 50. And U haul has 50, 70, 90, and my goal for this is only a hundred, so we are very close to not having to fund this anymore, which is great. So plus 90. And for our first big grocery trip, we have 50, 100, 20, 40, 60, 80, 90, 200, 10, 20. 30, 35, 40, 45, and 50. So 250. Yep, okay. This one's put here. So we will pop this back and grab 200s. 
two of these. And we have one, two, and 50 in groceries. And then month ahead to try to get ahead on some utility payments. We have 50, 70, 90, 110, 30, 50, 70, 80, 90, 200, 10, 20, 30, 40, 45, 50, 55, and 60. So 2, 60. So this should be 200, uh, 20, 40, 60, 81, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 85, 90, 95, and 200. Okay. And we will grab these. I have been so excited to do this. You have no idea. Okay. So, 1, 2, 50, and 260 is in a month ahead. Okay. And for deposit, we have 100, 52, 53, 350, 70, 90, 410, 30, 50, 70, 90, 4, 5, 10. 30, 50, 70, 96, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40, 45, and 50. Okay. <laughs> Threw me off for a second, but we need, we have 350, so this should be two, 200, oh my gosh, 51, 52, 20, 40, 60, 83, <laughs> where did I get that? We have 650, this should be 500. 20, 51, 52, 20, 40, 60, 83, 20, 40, 60, 84, 20, 40, 60, 65, 70, 75, 80, 85, 90, 95, 5. Okay. So we're going to put all this back. And one, two, three, four, five. And we have one, two, three, four, five, six, and six fifty saved for deposit. And in miscellaneous, we have 50, 70, 90, 110, 130, 150, 70, 80, 90, 95, 200, and 5. So Kind of trying to take the prettier ones. So we'll put 200 back. And grab two of these. And we have 205 in miscellaneous. Which will, oh my goodness, you guys, it's like an entirely new binder. There's so much room in there. That is nuts. <laughs> but that gives us a total of 3120 dollars if I added that all up correctly. And if we subtract the 2610 that we started with, we saved $510 towards move out this month, which is crazy. Our goal was only 500, so we were able to stick a couple extra bucks in there, which is great. Um, okay. And lastly, we're going to move on to our um, sinking funds binder. This binder and these little stickers are from Breezy Budget Shop. I'm not entirely sure if she has anything more than printables right now, but definitely go check her out just in case. Um, she, of course, she may bring them back as well. So we're going to start off with Franklin. He is my little puppy. <laughs> you just looked right over at him. He snuggled up on my bed over there. So we started the month with $30 and we're ending with 10, 20, 30, 40, 45, 50, 51, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. So 56. And if we take 56 minus the 30 we started with, we saved an extra 26, and that is on top of his meds, which is great. So, 
I'm going to actually do two, three, four, five, six. I'm going to keep these and 10, 20, 30, 35, 40. I'm going to grab because I'm just thinking about how much his meds cost. I do like to have ones in here. So 20, 30, 31, 2, 3, 4, 5. I need another one. Goodness gracious. 20, 40, 50, 51, 2, 3, 4, 5, and 56. So he is all set. And Austin is my boyfriend. He started the month with nothing, and we are ending with five. Um, his birthday was this past Tuesday. So we ended with a positive $5 difference in there. Um, parents started the month with 20, and we now have 20, 30, and 35. So we saved 15 in here, and this can't be any further condensed. And then medical, we started the month with 15, and we're ending with 20, 21, 2, 3, 4, and 5. So that is a positive $10 difference. We don't do a whole lot um, of like adding and stuff in our sinking funds throughout the month. It's kind of based off of need, but um, we were able to add a little bit in here this month. So we have 25 in medical. Car care started the month with 105. And I realized this winter, um, living up in New England, we had a few major snowstorms and a lot of ice. And my new car desperately needs snow tires, so I'm going to slowly save for next winter. But we have 100, 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, and 30. So 130, and that is positive 25 in here, and I'm going to 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, and 30. So, I'm going to grab a 20 and a 10, and we still have 130 in car care. And then Lily Budgets started the month with nothing, but we are saving for our next giveaway. So we have 10, 15, 20, and 25. And that will be a positive $25 change as well. And I am going to put these back and grab a 20. So that's 25 in here. And Pampers started the month with nothing and we did not make any change in here. Same with clothes and 20, uh, Tattoo still has $20 on a gift card. So that's all set. Jim started the month with 50 and we are ending with 20, 40, 45, 50, 55, 56, 7, 8, 9, and 60. So we saved an extra 10 in here. I will probably need to make um, a an order pretty soon. I get my supplements from PE Science and uh, I will probably need to order that pretty soon. So I'm just going to do 50 and 60. And that is good to go. And then gifts started the month with 10. And we have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, and 10. So no change in here. But that is okay. I'm going to exchange these ones for a 10. And gifts is good to go. These piles are getting wild over here. Okay. Christmas started the month with 
$70. They have a little savings tracker as well. Um, and now we have 20, 40, 60, 80, 90, 95, 96, 7, 8, 9, 100, 1, 2, 3, 4, and 5. So 105 is in here, and we can exchange these for 100. And we have 105. This is a prettier 5, so I'm just going to do that. Okay. So that is 105. And minus the um, 70 that we started with, that is a positive $35 difference. And then personal started the month with 20, and we have 25, so we saved $5 in here, and that is fully condensed. And lastly in here, we have travel. This envelope is from... Um, most of these envelopes actually are still from Breezy Budget Shop. These first few are from Budget with Amanda. Okay. And my um, extra debt and 52 weeks envelopes are from Dog Mom Crafts on Etsy or um, Terra Budgets on Inst on YouTube. I forgot to mention that before. And my emergency um, ones that look like my envelopes that look like this. Um, these ones are all from Kylie Mian Creations on Etsy as well. I did want to quickly mention that. So, where are we? <laughs> Travel. Started with 110 and we have 1105 and 110. So, no change here, but we can exchange these fives for a 10. And that is 110. And then we don't... Um, track rollover, but I am just going to 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, and 40. Um, I'm going to keep two fives, and then I'm going to take three tens. So this is a little easier. 10, 20, 30, 35, and 40. And this is just for extra miscellaneous spending. I don't um, track that. So that is it for the actual condensing. Goodness gracious, those are so much smaller. I honestly cannot believe it. So before we give this money a count to make sure that we have all of our ducks in a row, um, we are going to add this all up and see how much we actually were able to save this month. I am so excited. I'm so excited. Okay, so I am going to speed you guys through this, but I am just going to add up this end section here. So, okay, so I feel like somewhere I might have messed up, but I'm pretty sure if I did this correctly, that gives us a total of $7,589. Holy cannoli, we have over $7,500 in our sinking funds. That is absolutely nuts. Okay, I'm gonna try not to freak out. We are going to subtract the $6,586 that we started with, and that gives us a grand total. We saved gosh, you guys, we saved $1,003 this month. We saved over $1,000 this month. And on a low income, I am so stinking proud of myself. And that is not including the $1,000 um, as a buffer that we have for student loans. I don't count that because I will eventually just throw that towards my student loan payment. And then also we have our birthday challenge and our rollover which, I mean, we have 40 in rollover and over 50 in um, the birthday challenge that I'll probably end up spreading out and kind of evening out some of our um, numbers. But, oh my Lanta, $1,003. That is crazy. Okay. And honestly, 
if you are debating starting this cash envelope system, I just, I highly recommend that you just go for it. I mean, it is so worth it. I started this in May of last year. I have a very low income. I have worked three different jobs, uh, six days a week trying to get the ball rolling on this and rein in my spending. I was a very avid credit card user and I would it was so easy to swipe my card and just think it was free money but it definitely adds up and when the money is at home or it's in the bank well okay if it's at home in the safe it's not in the bank for you to just swipe your card you know what I mean it's so much easier to save it when you don't have it with you if that makes sense that's kind of my thought process but past that spiel we are going to take all of this money and give it a count Oh my gosh. You guys. You guys. Look at that. Look at that. Oh my gosh. What are we doing? What are we doing? <laughs> you know how much I just want to keep all of this? <laughs> it just stuff it right now. <laughs> it is ridiculous. Okay. With that, I am going to add this up with a calculator because I am going to mess up. So before we do that, let's just see what we should have. So we took out a thousand from Ally. Our dad, my dad <laughs> loaned me 2,500. We had 62 from insurance, 50 from our phone bill, 400 for student loans, 50 for Best Buy and 50 for our credit card. So in total, we should have $4,112 here. I'm very scared that it's not going to add up to $4,112, but we are going to hope and pray that it does. And if it doesn't, we will, we will figure that out because, <laughs> you know, we mess up quite a bit over here. But, well, again, not quite a bit, quite often. Okay. <laughs> So for hundreds, we have 100, 200. For 50s, we have 51, 52, 53, 54, 5500, 56, 57, 58, 59, 51,000. Holy cannoli, <laughs> just kind of hit me. 1,100 in 50s. For 20s, we have, because I can move this over, okay. For 20s, we have, oh my goodness, okay. 20, 40, 60, 81, 20, 40, 60, 82, 20, 40, 60, 83, 20, 40, 60, 84, let me, I felt like I messed up, so I'm just going to try to start over. 20, 40, 60, 81, 20, 40, 60, 82, 20, 40, 60, 83, 20, 40, 60, 84, 20, 40, 60, 85, 20, 40, 60, 86, 100, 20, 40, 60, 87, 100, 7, 20, 40, 60, 80, 800, 20, 40, 60, 89, 20, 40, 60, 80, 1,000, 1,000, 20, 40, 60, 81, 20, 40, 60, 82, 20, 40, 60, 83, 20, 40, 60, 84, 20, 40, 60, 85, 20, 40, 60, 86, 20, 40, 60, 80, 700, 20, 40, 60, 80, 800, 20, 40, 60, 80, 900. We have 1,900. So almost 2,000 in just the 20s. Goodness gracious. Oh, my Lanta. Okay. For 10s, we have 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90. Ninety. What? Okay. I messed up a little bit here. There we go. Okay. Ninety. One hundred. 
10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 200, 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 300, and then 10, 20, 30, 300, and 30, and just let that slide, and then four fives, oh, can I even hold these, no, okay, four fives, we have 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40, 45, 50, 55, 60, 70, 80, 90, 100. 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 200. 200, 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40, 45, 50, 55, 60, 65, 70, 75, 80, 85, 90, 95, 300, 300, 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40, 45, 50, 55, 60, 70, 80, 90, 400, I'm just going to add that really quick. <laughs> 400. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. What? What? <laughs> 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40, 45, 50, 55, 60, 70, 75, 80, 85, 90, 95, 100. I'm just gonna do it that way. 5, 10, 15, 20. Oh my lord. 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30. Okay. And for ones, we have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. 21, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 30. 31, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 40. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 51, and 2. Plus 52. Oh, thank goodness. 4,112. So, we at least we didn't mess that part up. Thank goodness. So, off camera, I am going to go ahead and separate all of this because I feel like this video is already incredibly long but with that you guys i hope you enjoyed i hope you guys all had a profitable fantastic love filled february and are ready to kick off march with a bang <laughs> um again if you are interested in the march budget booklet it is available on my etsy shop um and when we hit a thousand subscribers i will have another um sale I had a sale last week when we hit 900, so I think, you know, every milestone I might as well. Um, and yeah, so with that being said, please don't forget to hit that subscribe button. Your support means everything and it helps me more than you know. Don't forget to leave a like and drop a comment if you made it to the end of this video. Post or comment the dollar sign emoji because I'm, I'm feeling, I'm feeling good right now. <laughs> so Go ahead, drop that comment if you stay till the end. Thank you so much. And with that being said, I hope you have a fantastic rest of your day, week, month, year. And I will see you in the next one. Bye.